So we're reviewing Scranton, Pennsylvania, a little office uh, look back, so to speak, while eating Krispy Kreme donuts. We came down here just for... Just for Krispy Kreme donuts. Yeah. But while we're here... We're going to do a little office sightseeing while we're here. But we really came for the donuts. <laughs> Original since 1937. What? Did they already eat two? Bastards. So, folks, the only way to eat a Krispy Kreme donut is large bites. You have to take in the glaze, the texture of the donut. There's an intense flavor here. Oh, you may need to sit down too. Mm. Get a little weak in the knees. And just take it in for a minute. I don't know if you can see that. But, oh, delicious. Delicious. Mm, wonderful flavor. Just take it in. You can feel the sugar hitting your arteries almost immediately. So, had a and w root beer shake on the way to Krispy Kreme. Can I get two large uh, root beer floats, please? We have a fan watching us right now. <laughs> this is one of our many fans. This is actually from Kentucky. <laughs> oh, my dear God. Oh. I don't know how it would taste like that. Oh, wow. What the heck? Can't wait to wash down this A&W root beer float with a Krispy Kreme donut. Hell yeah. Prior to that, I needed the A&W shake to wash down the two slices of Pudgy's pizza. The cheese, the way it meets the pepperoni, the way it's coagulated with the sauce. Oh. I love good coagulation. <laughs> mm. Sauce just dripping right out of the... Look at that. Delicious. Delicious goodness. Mm. Oh, is that too much sauce for you, or that's good? That's a good amount. Just right. I'm not a big sauce fan, but, you know, I do understand that the way I'm folding it, trying to eat it like a New Yorker. <laughs> <laughs> This will tide me right over till we get to Krispy Kreme. <laughs> this is the office trip everybody should take. <laughs> Folks, that right there is a Krispy Kreme donut. If you still have it in your hand after two minutes, you're not doing something right. <laughs> so this is the Veterans Memorial Plaza. Really have no idea other than I know it's a memorial plaza. <laughs> yeah, so that's Columbus right there. Yeah. We're going that way. <laughs> Which way do we got to go? So we're taking a trip down Steamtown Mall right now. We're actually walking through to take in the sights of Scranton, Pennsylvania. Who would ever thought? Look at that coffee pot. Those are cool. What? Check that out. That's an old school retro coffee pot. It's a smeg. It's a smeg pot. We need that for... Jimbo Joe's coffee. Yeah. We use Smeg Pots. The Electric City sign, the clock tower, all featured on the Office TV show. Um, will now be featured on Talking Baloney as well. We might have a new introduction. So it's a little bigger exposure for them. A little bigger, a little bigger exposure. <laughs> There's no cars. I'm so, you have to follow the cars. Okay. Right now it's a stop. All right. So we're going <laughs> to. See, we're following. See, that's what I'm saying right there. You, you stopped me from crossing the street. <laughs> now I feel like we need to cross. 
They don't do jaywalking tickets anymore. Hey, look at that car. They got Wonder Woman decal, window decals. Not for my car or anything like that. She, she is right behind me. We need to go to Whiskey Dicks. Whiskey Dicks. The name alone says we need to go there. Folks, traffic's a little heavy. Traffic alert right now. Uh, sign saying it's not safe to cross. These dumbasses over there across the street in the dress and the white shirt. Don't seem to know that it's not safe. These folks here are using the crosswalk as a safety device. Man. There's more cops driving around Scranton than there is at the donut shop. <laughs> it's crazy. We go to Krispy Kreme, not one cop. You walk outside of Krispy Kreme, everywhere. <laughs> they want a Polaroid camera and t shirt. The building got it, and just sell the t shirt for $5 for a Polaroid shot. I'd buy one for 10 <laughs> I see people come and take his pictures and all kinds of stuff. Sure, the camera's nice on your phone, but a Polaroid forever. Yep. <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs> Probably sure they wanted to sell us some meth. He was a good salesman though. Well, I probably would have bought some. I mean, so. he clearly has a business plan. Wildlife center. Got your squirrels that aren't afraid of people. Clearly not afraid of people. Like, I mean, I've never been that close to a squirrel before. Hey, Mr. Squirrel. He's like, hey. And folks, Oh, crikey, we're gonna sneak in up on the little fella. <laughs> hey, Mr. Squirrel. Perhaps you could tell us where the uh, Alfredo's Pizza Place is. No? Okay, apparently he doesn't want to talk today. Marketplace. I think there's a parking area. Well, yeah, I hope so. You got a boss gobs. Yeah, we should probably pay attention to the traffic. You'd think they'd have a Dunder Mifflin Welcome Center here. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. I'm sorry, real crap town. <laughs> and folks, we've been here for a while. We're having to search out the places on our own. Like, there's no tour guide. There's no. Wait, one mile. You're gonna turn left on Seventh Street. All right, turn left on Seventh. My nest, my navigator, folks, talking. I was gonna say tour guide. Our, our tour guide. Three hundred and fifty feet. You're gonna turn left on Seventh Street. We had to hire our own tour guide. Okay, <laughs> folks. I give directions, I'm the navigator, I sexually harass people on accident. If a customer wants a pickle, you give them a pickle, right? And yep, looks like we're going deeper into suburbia. You're going to turn left in point one miles on Elm Street. Okay, every town's got an Elm Street, just ask Freddy Krueger. Wow. All right, folks, we're turning left. We got the China Moon takeout. We got the uh, A&A auto sales. Now we're going to turn left on Beach Street. Alfredo's Pizza, right there. There's Alfredo's, but we're going to Port Richards. Okay. Thanks. I see a bowling lane. There's not even a sign. Again, folks, this is the problem with the office tour. You can't find anything. This. <laughs> <laughs> Port Richards Public. So this is the street we're on right now. Let's just take a look here, folks. We got a truck stop. Merging with an empty back side of the plaza parking lot. Is because it on the side of the bowling alley? I don't know. There's nothing here that would deem that there's a restaurant around here anywhere. <laughs> okay, let's drive around the front here. Maybe. Guy gave me a look that only somebody from Scranton could give you. Because <laughs> he doesn't know where anything is. <laughs> Just like the rest of us. <laughs> going in.
That's what I'm saying. Like, somebody died right there. There's a shrine. Probably looking at the sign. Delicious.